Saturday afternoon saw London Irish host Gloucester in round 18 of the Aviva Premiership. It was all change at the Medeski, with new men Declan Kidney and Les Kiss coming in to take control of the side. And it was the 12th place team who started the brighter, taking the lead as James Marshall landed a penalty on five minutes. They then extended that advantage as they got the first score of the match through Josh McNally. The second row man powering over after a well-worked maul. This impressive start from Declan Kidney's men continued as Pete Van Zyl crossed. The Grey College schoolboy got the better of opposite number Willie Heinz and darted over. Gloucester had to respond quickly, and they did. Firstly through hooker James Hansen, bundling his way over, then the Cherry and Whites cut the gap to five as Tom Marshall crossed. Gloucester took the lead just before the break through a Lewis Ludlow try. Henry Trinder, the provider, picking up a loose pass to set the back row forward clear. Gloucester were quickest out of the blocks in the second half and got the bonus point through Mark Atkinson, the centre powering through the tackle of Theo Brophy Clues to dot down. They then increased the lead to 14 on 56 minutes, Marshall getting his second. A superb switch from Burns and Atkinson created space and Heinz was on hand to set the winger through. Irish didn't lie down and they responded with a try from Brophy Clues. The fly half showing great determination to score, and then, with eight minutes remaining, they secured the try bonus point. Joe Coconasiga finishing superbly. Heinz feeling the full power of the winger as he steamrolled through the scrum half. However, it wasn't enough as Gloucester took the full five points, leaving Irish ten points adrift with four games to go. The final score at the Medeski: London Irish 29, Gloucester 33.